are hanging out in Plymouth and enjoying the beautiful view, trying to find a little gold nugget. Cody is there making new friends and finding new places. Cody's caravan. I am. I'm, I'm telling you, these are my two favorite people. I love Elizabeth and Steve. I'm having such a good time. So, Steve, we're in the, the bunkhouse now that you've, you've fixed right. up and everything. But there's this giant long board above my head, and I was dying to ask you about that. Well, uh, it came off the wall behind you, and it was 22 and a half feet long. And I just couldn't bring myself to cut it because you're never going to get a no. board like that again. So I just hung it up. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. It is art. It is art. So you could actually stay here. Like you could spend the night here and you could have a lovely adventure here. You can stay the night here. Um, we're on Airbnb. It's the bunkhouse in Plymouth. And we do family adventures. We do scavenger hunts for kids and adults. Adults like our scavenger hunts and you can stay more than once. We tweak the scavenger hunts. You'll learn a little bit about history because it's a historic scavenger hunt all around town. Um, we do uh, historic tours. We do ghost tours. Um, we, we act as a concierge service. We really love what we do. We love having people stay and it's just a family adventure. And you love Plymouth. You really do love it here, don't you? We love Plymouth. This house is set up as a, as a museum. You can look at the walls. You can find out about the history. Um, we, Steve is fifth generation in town. Um, I grew up in Shenandoah Valley. Um, we are part of the revitalization effort. We think that Plymouth is just a literal gold mine. It really is. And, and there's so much history here being overlooked and it's it's our goal like we bought these as teardowns it's our goal to to take teardowns and build them up and restore Plymouth and it's a great place for I mean you can bring your kids and you can walk to the public pool and you can walk to the park you can go on a scavenger hunt you can play a game up at our old town that's a fence <laughs> so it's just a great place for families and couples so if people would like to stay here what do they need to do um, go on Airbnb and it's the bunkhouse in Plymouth and just Airbnb the bunkhouse at Plymouth and you'll find it. Okay. Or you can go to um, uh, the other side of country.com or Elizabeth .com. But in Airbnb in Plymouth, we're like, we have like three listings of five. So, mm -hmm. okay. okay. Yeah. So, odds are you're going to find them yeah, on that. Exactly. Uh, speaking of which, you have another place that you want to show us. Now, yes. why is this place magical? This place is magical because it has our fairy garden. It has. Um, it has a, a full fairy garden with a castle. It's based on a book and there are violets and one day a year, if you happen to be there on that day, you could fall through a violet and end up in the magical town of Flaburbia. <laughs> but it's, there's a full fairy garden and we do tea parties for everyone and um, kids that go through, they like the hot chocolate better, but it's just a magical <laughs> place for kids to play. I feel like we should go check that out. Let's go. Let's do it. We're gonna go check that out. Coming up in just a bit. Back to you guys. Bye. 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 Beautiful spot. Thanks, Co.